Hello friends. Recently, Oracle has released Oracle 23 AI, which was previously Oracle 23 C. Now they have named it as 23 AI means artificial intelligence. They have released many new features, but I felt we can discuss some three or four features which are useful for people who are giving interviews. Generally in the interviews, they will test how updated you are with the latest versions. They have come up with very interesting new features, namely Oracle True Cache. And now they have built SQL firewall into the database and uh, querying graphs with SQL queries and AI vector search. So let us get into the first one. First one is Oracle True Cache. If you are accessing any web enabled application, if you give a query which has to touch the Oracle database, then what happens is it has to do a round trip. It has to go to database, query the database and give the result back to the web form. So this we call as round trip. Generally, this is also one performance issue while tuning web enabled forms which have a lot of SQL queries. So for such problems, Oracle True Cache is a very good solution. Now it won't go to the backend, it will access the true cache and from here the result is given back to that. So Oracle claims that it, it's a very good feature and it gives good performance, we have to see practically. So next one is in-memory vector join enhancement. It has extended its support to many different types of joins like multi-level hash joins, semi-joins, auto joins and these are in-memory vector joins, okay, not j normal ones. So how, we, how will you come to know whether it is using this feature or not? In explain plan you can see in-memory. So once you see that you will be sure that Oracle is using this in-memory vector join new feature. And third one is graphs. Till now, what happens is for graph purpose, they used to go for a different database. Now, this property graphs can be used for analyzing complex relationships, which is very useful. We need not go to any, any new graph database for this purpose. So Oracle has given extended support for this. So now you can use this property graphs using SQL. Okay. So definitely nowadays, uh, many business analysts, they, they prefer to analyze relationships using graphs because one picture speaks thousand words. Next feature is AI driven SQL tuning advisor. Oracle uses many LLM large language models for giving better execution plans so that queries can be run with very good performance. So AI driven SQL tuning advisor. Next feature is AI vector. Under this AI vector, there are two types of searches, similarity search and one is another search which we are going to discuss. This is uh, useful while working with uh, searching, semantic search of documents, images, like social media is there, like a lot of different types of uh, data will be there. So searching such ones, this can be used. Another search is RAG, retrieval augmented generation. This uses large language models so that it can be used for chatbots, for internal external users and many document searches. So these are some Oracle 23 AI features which uses artificial intelligence that is a buzzword now. For further information if you want then you can use these references. Thank you.